show you how to make a micro adjustment fence using cheap bolts. You can dial in the fence very precisely. I made this because say you need to make a strip of wood and it needs to fit somewhere, maybe a fence like this or something else, and it's always a pain to put the fence up to the the board and then micro adjust it by moving the fence over a little bit you end up going too far and then you don't know how far to go back and it's just always a pain so I made this uh, I'll show you how to do this with smaller strips in a future video but here I want to make 45 angle cuts on this so what you do is you don't need to line up your fence at all I'll mess up the adjustment here just to show you okay you just clamp it down and then place your work piece here and line it up to the fence, I mean to the blade, using this micro adjuster here. So thinner or thicker. So right now it looks like I'm actually that was pretty good. Let's mess it up. It's thinner, 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 thinner. Okay, so now I should be catching on the front of the blade. So let's go thicker. Thicker, 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 thicker. Each turn is a one eighteenth of an inch because that's an eighteenth, eighteen inch threaded bolt, eighteen threads per inch. So um, what you can do is line up the front by going thinner until you hit the front. I'm hitting the front and back off a little. Now adjust the back. The back seems to be a Make it a little thinner. So now it's catching the back, so I'm going to back off, make it thicker. Still catching, make it thicker. Still catching. Okay, no longer catching the back. And I'm catching the front very, very little bit. So now I can incrementally make the cut a little bit to meet my needs, make it a little bit thinner incrementally. So I take this off, and now I want to go an eighteenth of an inch thinner. So I made a little dial here, and I'll just loop this around one time. So now that's an eighteenth of an inch thicker on that side, sorry, thinner and an eighteenth of an inch thinner on this side. Okay, so now this will slide through and it'll catch both sides of the blade. And I may just, just made a micro adjustment. Um, it's a lot more convenient than trying to wiggle my fence. And I'll show you how I made this. So this is a bolt, six inches long. I Drill the hole into the wood to about here. Where the thinner hole goes all the way through, and a little thicker hole receives this nut. And now, as you turn this, it pulls the nut in and out. See that? Now, you're going to have to do two things. You're going to have to sandwich the nut with a lock washer with another nut, and then a washer on this part of the fence. This holds this in place and keeps the bolt from pushing in and out and adjusting your fence when you don't want it adjusted. It's pretty strong. You will have to tweak the the distance from here to here to put a right amount of tension on this bolt to hold onto the wood. If you don't put enough tension, it slides in and out. If you put too much tension, uh, you just can't turn it. It's not convenient. But here you can see there's no slop fits rather nicely. I'll make another video later to show you how to make very small cuts with this. Uh, you don't have to get your fingers involved or even use push sticks.